Hey beautiful soul, this is Katie with the channel Weather Shaman. Welcome if you're new and a big hello to my returning subscribers. Uh, right now I'm outside in nature by this lovely pond doing some reflecting on something that came to my mind today. It's a spiritual topic that I wish to discuss with you all and that is love and unity versus fear and division. Beautiful soul. Love is a force that brings us together, where we can see our commonalities rather than our differences, right? Love is from the heart. Love is from our creator, from God, from the universe, right? Fear is of the enemy. Fear wants to divide and conquer. Fear wants us to look at our differences and to be frightened and to not be trusting of one another. So let us all lead in love versus fear, especially in the remainder of this year, right? We have a lot going on in the world right now that is trying to divide and separate the people. Let us tune that out to the best of our ability and raise our vibrations way, way up to a higher reality a higher vibration. Let us ascend together from 3D rigid belief systems to 5D, to unconditional love, okay? To being there for our brothers and sisters, to once again looking at the commonalities and the love that connects us all versus the differences, all right? Let us lead in love rather than fear. And if someone comes at you and criticizes you, puts you down or gets on you for thinking or believing a certain way, you know, all you have to do is say, I respect your belief system. I respect you for believing the way you wish to believe. And I expect that you respect me as well, right? And love them and thank them for the lesson. And it's okay to love them at a distance. <laughs> Sometimes we need to love certain people at a distance, especially if they're trying to create chaos and havoc in our lives. Beautiful soul, just know this is a form of self-love. If anybody in your life is trying to bring you down, make you feel less than, or trying to control the way you think or believe, that is not cool, okay? Being free is your birthright. Being free is your birthright. Don't allow anyone or anything to dim your light, okay? And don't allow anyone to bring down your vibration into a fear, into a lower vibrational state, okay? Now is a time to tune out any lower vibrational energies from TV, media, from any lower vibrational family members, lower vibrational friends, or people in your life who are just still caught up in the 3D way of life, right? Now is a time for us to rise up and ascend into this new earth, into this higher vibrational reality. Fifth dimensional living is all about helping one another, giving without expecting anything in return, unconditional love, helping one another, right? And joining forces. Doesn't matter what religion you are, what race or ethnicity or sex or gender, okay? It doesn't matter what your background is. We are all one. We are all one collective soul, okay? And we are all connected through love. Let us all continue to remain connected through love. It is only fear that can separate us and divide us and isolate us, right? So let's not let fear win. <laughs> Love wins. Love always wins, right? So beautiful soul, just know it's okay to love certain people at a distance, to preserve your energy. It's okay to set healthy energetic boundaries to protect your sacred space to protect your energy and sending you so much positive energy look at that beautiful sunlight absorb some of that vitamin d energetically through the camera at this time and just know you are that light and you have the ability to allow your light to outshine the darkness to outshine lower vibrational energies okay so beautiful soul just know you are so loved you are not alone. If you're going through something right now, if you're going through any adversity or spiritual warfare, 
Just know you are loved, you are divinely protected, and don't allow anyone or anything to take away your power, okay? Don't allow anything or anyone to take away your power. Imagine a bubble of divine protection all around you, okay? You can call on Archangel Michael, Jesus, the Holy Spirit, your angels, your guides, whatever it is you believe in that brings you comfort for divine protection and support. Call on the armor of God, the full armor of God each day for divine protection at this time as there's a lot of hidden spiritual warfare taking place at this time. Protect your energy, raise your vibration way, way up through more self-love, self-care, and strong energetic boundaries with anybody in your life that may be bogging you down energetically. And I just want you to know once again, you are so loved and you matter. You are so loved and you matter and you are not alone, okay? And please let me know what your thoughts are on this topic in the comment section below. Please leave a comment and let me know what your thoughts are on this. I'm really curious. We can get a discussion going and any more spiritual topics that you wish to discuss on this channel in the future, let me know. Okay. I'm just sending you so much peace, love, and light from me to you. Don't allow anyone or anything to steal your light, to steal your joy. You are so loved and you matter. Do what you love, love what you do, follow your joy, call upon that armor of God for divine protection every day, and all will be well. I want to thank you so very much for tuning in. Look at this beautiful nature that surrounds me. Get outside in nature to recharge energetically and to dispel any heavy, negative, bad vibes back down into Mother Earth to transmute it, right? Mother Earth has the ability to transmute. Okay, take off your shoes, ground, walk around barefoot. This is what I'm doing right now, and it's really helping me to reset energetically. So I appreciate you tuning in with me today. Once again, I'm sending you so much peace, love, and light from me to you. Have a wonderful, blessed day or evening wherever you are in the world at the time of this video. Namaste and much love.